Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Rabbi zidni ilma, Rabbi shrah li sadri wa yasir li amri wa ahlul uqdatan min lisani yufakali. The topic that we are going to be to, doing today is proportions and we will be covering direct proportions first. Alright. So the logic of direct proportion is that when one thing increases, the other thing increases as well. Now in order to solve such questions, you have two methodologies. One of them is cross multiplication. And the other one is using the formula, which is y is equals to kx, whereby k is a constant. Now let us dive us, uh, let us dive into the questions. So the first question that you have over here is: 108 books have a mass of 30 kg. Find the mass of 150 such books. So first of all, uh, we will be using method one, which is cross multiplication. Write down books over here, and write down mass over here. So we do know that 108 books have a mass of 30 kgs, but we don't know the mass of 150 such books. So in, in front of 150, write x. Now cross multiply. So 108x is equal to 150 multiplied by 30. 108x is equals to 150 multiplied by 30 would give you an answer of 4500 x is equals to 4500 divided by 108 all right so when you divide 4500 with 108 you get an answer of x is equals to 41.66 which you can round off to 41.67 kg so if 108 books had a mass of 30 kgs 150 books have a mass of how much 41.67 kg now let us move on to part 2 as well in part 2 it says, again write down books and mass. 108 books have a mass of 30. In part 2 it says the number of such books have a mass of 20 kg. Now this time around you are not told how many books there are. You are told that the mass of the books is 20. And books are how many x we don't know. So then again cross multiply. 108 multiply by 20 is equals to 30 multiplied by x which is 30x. So when you are going to multiply 108 with 20 you would get an answer of 2160 is equals to 30x. x is equals to 2160 divided by 30. So now when you are going to divide 2160 by 30 you would get an answer of x is equals to 72 books. Alright. So where the mass of uh, there were 20, 72 books which have a mass equivalent to 20 kg right so therefore this was how to solve questions using method 1 now let's move on to method 2 moving on now let's solve questions using method 2 so on the left hand side of the screen you can see question 3 it says if x is directly proportional to y and x is 4.5 and y is equal to 3 find an equation connecting x and y so now x is directly proportional to y all right so this means what this means x is equals to k y now in order to find the connecting equation you will always be given in the first part you will always be given the values of x and y both so that you can find out k so x is 4.5 4.5 is equals to k and the value of y is 3 so k is equals to 4.5 divided by 3 all right so k is equals to it's 1.5 the value of k is 1.5 so now the connecting equation would be x is equals to 1.5 y all right this is your connecting equation all right you can also write it as 3 upon 2 instead of writing 1.5 you can write 3 upon 3, uh, 3 upon 2 moving on to part 2 now since you have found out the equation you will be using the equation to solve all the other parts so in part 2 it says the value of x when y is equals to 6 so use the equation x is equals to 1.5 y x is equals to 1.5 and instead of y plug in the value which is 6 x is equals to how much 1.5 multiply by 6 which is equivalent to 9 so x is equals to 9 same way you will be solving part 3. What was your equation? x is equals to 1.5 y. Alright. 
the value of y when x is equal to 12. This time around you are given the value of x. So instead of x write 12, 12 is equal to 1.5y. So in order to find y, y is equal to 12 divided by 1.5. So 12 divided by 1.5 would give you an answer of 8. And hence you are done with the question. That's it for today's class. Assalamu alaikum and take care. Allah Hafiz.